Hey, what's up guys? It's Erin, and to no one's surprise, I'm dying about Red vs. Blue. Um, this is episode 12, uh, Blue vs. Red, and the whole thing for it is, in a box canyon in the middle of nowhere, two teams are locked in a stalemate over a game of Capture the Flag. This is Blue vs. Red, the Desert Gold Chronicles, which is very unsettling to see, for the record, considering it's like, no, god, it's like, it's, like, it's Red vs. Blue, like, he, seeing it any other way is unsettling, and I think that's that's like part of the whole thing that they're doing is like it is very unnerving to see something that has been like portrayed as red versus blue written the other way around. But this looks like where they were vacationing, sort of. I think at least this establishing shot. So maybe Griff is gonna come and save the day. I would be very, 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 very okay with that. I also still want to know why Temple and the Blues and Reds don't have a Griff. Or whatever his name would be, Gif. Don't they don't have a Griff figure? That'll yeah. Like I, I want to know why. Cause there's a reason for that. And and clearly it's because they're evil and they're definitely probably not sim troopers. And by probably not, they're they're pretty much definitely not sim troopers at this point. But it's interesting that they didn't have Griff because they didn't necessarily know that Griff wasn't going to come with them. So it'd be very strange. And I wanna know who took Wash and Carolina. I wanna know who he is. I'm bitter. I want that to be okay. I have concerns. Okay, I'm clapping a lot. I'm just gonna start playing this because I just I need to know the answers to questions. Griff, right? No. Oh wait, no, it's the gold, so he wouldn't be there. Sir, they're making another push. So, shoot back. Victory is close at hand. No, it's not. must be around here somewhere. But we're completely- But nothing. A soldier follows orders no matter what. You do what I tell you, son. Yes, sir. Return fire, Cronut. With what? We're out of ammo. I'm shooting blanks over here. In that case, we're gonna have to resort to plan B. Oh, God. You suck! You're bad at math! You have table manners that leave much to be desired! You smell yeah. like maybe you forgot to wear deodorant today! Oh. Your mother's lasagna is mediocre! Oh, They're shit. attempting to insult us, sir! Yeah, I fucking noticed. <laughs> this ought to shut them up. Ooh, my turn! Let me try! Not happening, dude! Oh, come on! How come you always get the sniper right? Because you're busy getting the prisoner. Also because go fuck yourself! Same! Mamma mia! They got Lorenzo! Quest unknown Ilamia. This is not my perfect subject, not relatable. Mamma right. mia, that's we a spicy Lorenzo! Robot. Now give us back our base or we smash the Goomba! Whoa, dude! That is super racist! No, it isn't! It's pretty racist, dude! No, a Goomba! Like in Mario! E ancora resista! <laughs> Whatever, everyone shut up or we're all gonna find out what kind of filling is inside this cannoli. Ugh, not better. Oh no, Worse. what are we gonna do? Uh, ideas, anybody? Ooh, I got one. If you guys had to get shot somewhere in your body, where would you do it? Not oh, now, shit. Biff. We're in the middle Biff. of a war. It's a legit question, dudes. How about the pinky toe? That little piggy's had it coming for ages. True. Are you crazy? All the nerves in your whole body end in your toes, idiot. I want to take a bullet, not feel pain. The blue bastards have hidden their flag something. So they did fierce. have one. Oh, and they have Lorenzo, Surge. Blast! We can't let them keep the robot. I've hid all our top secret battle station plans in that droid. We'll have to hold out for reinforcements. How's our ammo? Listen up, you dirty blue bastards. Red team is graciously and selfishly willing to open negotiations. Your base are belong to us. Surrender now and we'll spare your meaningless lives. Christ, this song again. Who's your negotiator? <laughs> Me! No deal. Your last two parlays ended with literal backstabbing. Oh, send shit. Send someone else. How about Biff? He's expendable if the talks break down. Yeah, whatever. The butt? Are you insane? That's right next to my Jingo Jingos, okay? Bullets splinter. Jingo How about Jingo, the arm? Really? Arteries. Ooh, the ear. What? Yeah, I can't hear you because some idiot shot my ear off. No way. Uh, there's gotta be some part of the body that's expendable. You just need to get shot in the appendix. If only I was a book. Biff! Biff! <laughs> Sam Hay! Himley! In the back! Okay? Was that supposed to be Pig Latin? Can you hurry it up, Temple? Preferably before they find my Master Vittorium! Stop it, man. Stop 
what? You're staring at me. I am not. R2. I know what you're thinking. No, you don't. This is all my fault. I didn't, look, I didn't say a thing. Well, you're right, okay? I'm guilty. Whoa, can we talk um, about this later? All right, everyone is staring at us. Fine. Uh, trade you a base for a robot. Yeah, dude. It was the same damn shit with the same damn idiots. They get a thing, we steal the thing, we get a tank, they blow it up. It's like living in a fucking Looney Tunes cartoon. We didn't know it yet, but all that was about to change. Context. Halt! Who goes there? Uh, it's me, going on patrol. No, you're talking to your best friend. What? Me! Oh, right, right yeah, of course I am. Loco, why don't you get some sleep? He looks like okay. he's wearing a white armor and it's really unsettling. God, same. Whatever. Leave me alone, Sky Puppet. Sky Puppy or Sky Puppet? That, ooh, animated scene, animated scene. Who's showing up? Who's showing up? Heads up. Holy fuck! Where the hell did you get one of these? Shore leave. Drink up, you damn dirty blue. Hey, you remember Pearson's class, history freshman year? Uh, I remember someone drawing dicks on my notebook every Ooh. time I went to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, and then he did those notebook checks? <laughs> the look on your stupid face. <laughs> Fucking asshole. What are you bringing that up for? Georgina was in that class. You know, that, that's when we met. I remember it took you two years to finally ask her out. Now that was a fun day. Fun. Right. Yeah, you managed to unite the entire fucking cafeteria in a slow clap, you jackass. <laughs> Ooh. Ugh. Dick move. We should have joined the fucking Coast Guard. Yep. I bet the Coast Guard doesn't divide its people into teams and have them shoot at each other with loaded assault rifles. Oh, they actually do. They just use harpoon guns instead. Jesus. What? So you two were friends before the service. You knew each other. Yeah, that's right. We grew up together. We enlisted together. Buddy team, they called it. Freelancer overlooked that fact when they assigned us to opposite teams in oh, the same shit. canyon. We found that fact out later. Was that at the freelance- This isn't an interview, Dylan Andrews. Shut the fuck up and listen. Jesus. The conversation inevitably turned to the same place it always did. You ever wonder what the fuck we're doing here? Like all the goddamn time? The way I see it, it's gotta be some super important government shit. Some, like, critical testing stuff. When we oh, get out, Carolina there's gonna be medals, awards, fucking parades for us, dude. For you. Not me, I'm getting out soon. Yeah? Yeah, medical discharge. Oh, shit. For real? I'm not fucking with you. This whole situation is garbage enough to begin with, but at least we're in it together. We're in it against each other, if you haven't noticed. You know what I mean. <laughs> I would never do that to you. Red team had a shore leave a while back, and I snuck home back to Earth. When a wall stowed away on a transport. For real? Yeah, it wasn't easy, but I had to see Georgina. Keeping the old flame alive. Wait, she hasn't moved on? No, dude, it's super serious between us. That's why I need to get back. I don't want to say you owe me one, but... <sighs> yeah, yeah. I'm the only reason you're fucking here. You know, if I had frequent flyer miles for every one of your guilt trips, I could cover your entire ride back to Earth. So you're in? Way I see it. It's my job to shoot you anyway. Hey, they shit. might give me a medal for this. That That's a spirit, all right. So, like... brass tacks, my pinky finger, I need you to shoot it off, all right? I've thought about it a lot, and that's gonna be my best bet. That's Done. why he wanted a... I've been waiting to shoot you since we were kids. Oh, right, no. Not now. We need witnesses, reports and shit, all right? I'll need the pension when I get out. I could shoot you now for practice. Oh, good idea. I figured we could try a bunch of places and you can let me know what hurts the least. Brilliant. Semi or full auto? Riddle me with holds. Thank God I brought along those explosive rounds. Mm, what are oh friends God. for? The plan was simple. Biff gets hurt, gets a medical discharge. First class ticket back home. But you know what they say. No plan survives first contact with the enemy. 
shot him in the wrong place. Well, I would not put it past him. I would not put it past Temple to be like, no, fuck you, and shoot him in the head. But, I mean, that's current Temple. That may not have been old Temple, but... So Freelancer intervened. It must have been the early days of Freelancer. Huh. So Carolina showed up. Man, this next episode, shit, I'm like... I'm trying to figure out, like, what happened, but also, like, how early was this in Freelancer? Because, like, I'm just trying to figure out, like, where this is in the time frame, because, like, the whole stations with the simulation outposts, they existed before Church was implanted into them. So, like, was it in the, was it in that period? Did they have their signature armor then, or were they still in, like, the basic UNSC guard? Because if that's the case, then we could see Carolina's face again, which I am very on board for, but I don't know. Alright, I will see you guys.